The ionization energy of bromine is the energy associated with which of the following? A. Atomic bromine in the gas phase yields bromine positive one ion in the gas phase plus an electron. B. Diatomic bromine molecule in the liquid phase yields two bromine positive one ions in the gas phase plus two electrons. C. Atomic bromine in the gas phase plus an electron yields bromide ions in the gas phase. Or D. Diatomic bromine molecules in the liquid phase plus two electrons yields two bromide ions in aqueous solution. The ionization energy of an atom is defined as the energy needed to remove an electron from an isolated atom. Choices C and D do not involve removal of an electron. They involve gaining of electrons. So we can eliminate these choices. Choice B can also be eliminated because the bromine atoms in Br2 are not isolated. By isolated atoms, we mean atoms not bonded to any other atom and nowhere near any other atom, which is the case in the gas phase. Choice B involves much more than just ionization of bromine atoms. It involves vaporization of diatomic bromine molecules, followed by the dissociation of the diatomic molecules in the gas phase to individual bromine atoms, then by the ionization of the bromine atoms. Therefore, the correct answer is A. By the way, choice C is the opposite of choice A. The energy associated with this process is called the electron affinity of bromine. The electron affinity of an atom is the energy associated with the gaining of one electron by an atom.